What's up, YouTube? So, earlier in my last video, from like yesterday, I said that I would be doing more than just Hot Wheels and Matchbox videos. Which was true, but I also said that I would have another Hot Wheels and Matchbox video coming out. Which this is it. But, I know that I don't have as many Hot Wheels as other, like, YouTubers. But, I do have enough that it's going to take two videos to finish to show you all the, like, Hot Wheels I have in Matchbox. So, there are a couple more Matchbox that I'm trying to get. But, I don't have a few, like, a ton that are my favorite right now with me. Because, I guess I really haven't gotten a lot of Matchbox, but... I have a couple that are really nice. So, anyways, on to the video. So, I will be showing you through the two videos, I think 62 cars. But, I'm gonna split that in half. So, 31 cars, hopefully, in this video, and then 31 cars in the other one. So, I'm gonna show you these. So, as I said in my last, I think I said this in my last video. Uh, I've gotten five packs before, so this is the, this is the, like, plastic container, and I put my top five favorites in this plastic container, so I'm gonna show you those first, and then I have this nine pla- nine plaque, nine pack plastic container, which is empty right now, because I will be picking, well, actually, I'm gonna let you guys pick what nine cards I put in this after I show you these, so, but it will be after the two videos, which I will hopefully get out today. But, so you guys will get to pick what cars go in here after I show you them, after the two videos. Man, this is confusing. Anyways, let's move on. So I'm going to show you these five cars first. So I'm going to start at the top, which would be my favorite car and my fastest nonetheless. Like, literally, I, I raced these because I have a couple tracks. Of course, this is my car. These are my cars. Mine forever. And the reason they are is because I do special things to my car. Like, hmm, not a lot. I mean, it looks pretty. It looks pretty dang good just the way it is. I mean, I kept everything. The color is really nice. But I did add the light in the back. So that, yeah, that's the red light for the Bugatti. But that's all I did. And this is mine forever. Nobody gets this. Now, this is my favorite car, not just because of the light, but because of, like, just it all together, like, the colors. I cannot wait for the next color of this. So, yeah, this is number one. And it's kind of hard to see on the bench thing, but I guess all you can see is the C, so. Anyways, on to the next one. In the five pack. McLaren P1. So, I guess the only thing that I did to this car was I tried to do a touch-up on the paint, like the white paint, because since I have it in this plastic container and it's not the right size for everything, sometimes the paint just chips off a little bit, so I tried to touch it up. But now that I see it, it kind of doesn't completely blend in, like right there. You can kind of see that. So, I kind of messed up, but like if from a distance still looks roughly the same so this is my second favorite car it's not my complete fastest but I'm about to get another red McLaren P1 part of a different set but I'm not getting the full set so we'll see and I like the design on the back can't really tell but it has like the pipe there it is and like the red lines for the lights it's pretty good and it has a logo in the front that's nice so second favorite car so now move on to my third favorite car it is, it is a Porsche, I, I normally say Porsche, you guys will have to comment down below if it's Porsche or Porsche, because the Porsche, the way you spell it, there's an E at the end, so I'm not sure, but Porsche 918 Spider, and this is a nice one, I have three of these, and they're all the same color, but has, I got them all, because they're, I haven't gotten any of the other colors. I was too late. But it has a nice design. And I didn't do anything to this one. Nice wheels. Like the front. You can't really tell from the glare. I gotta figure out how to get different lighting. But maybe that will help. Nothing really on the back. I didn't do anything on the back. I didn't do anything to this car. But 
It's just a nice car. So that's my third favorite. Now, I'm gonna turn on this light. Didn't do much. I'm gonna keep it on. Okay, so, my fourth favorite car in the five pack. Lamborghini Aventador J. The new 2019 Lamborghini Aventador J. Which, the only one I did to this one was, you can't really tell, but the back lights. Yeah, right there. Maybe you can tell better that way. They're like, right in there. Back lights. So, that's the only thing I did to this. Once again, these cars are mine, and you're not going to get them, even if you want them. That's too bad for you. And I did do the side panel things. I made them black so that it looked a little bit different, I guess. I don't know. But, once again, love this car. It's my fourth favorite. Now, my fifth favorite, and that will conclude the five-pack. This actually came in that five-pack. It is the Pagani Hyra Roadster. I don't know if it's Hyra or Hyra, but it's a Roadster. And it's pretty, it's pretty nice, in my opinion. You guys will have to judge it, but I haven't done anything to this. It hasn't really needed anything. I like how you can't really tell, but it has, like, it has, like, the name of the car right over here and then the hot wheel sign and yeah it's just a nice car and the lights in the front and the stripe down the middle that's cool so yeah fifth favorite now let's go down to my other favorites i'll go let's see i just did five so about uh five more fives and then a two okay so Starts off with my other Bugatti. The reason that this one wasn't in the five favorites is because, I mean, it still looks nice, but it's not my fastest Bugatti, which my my other Bugatti looks basically the exact same, only the wheels, this one, the wheels kind of rubbed off a little bit, and this one didn't, but, so this is not my favorite Bugatti, because it's not quite as fast as this one, so it would probably be in speeds, maybe... Th 5th place, but, I mean, not all these, like, 5 favorite cars are based on speed, so, this would probably be my, like, 5th fa fastest car, but, I basically just did the same on it, you got all the same details as this one, so, yeah, 6th fav favorite car, and I'll put that down over here, yeah, and then, it moves on to this other Bugatti, so, I did kind of redo the paint job. I kept a little bit of it. So, it is the Bugatti Veyron. So, I did make it mostly black with Sharpie, which it kind of rubs off a little bit, so it wasn't really the greatest plan. And, it's not my fastest car, so... But, I did try to keep a little bit of the blue on the bottom... I was thinking about if I should switch that to orange, like the actual Bugatti Veyron that made 268 miles per hour. I believe that's right. There were two Bugatti Veyrons, but yeah. So, it kind of still has the lights in the back. They're not really red anymore. I gotta redo the EB on the back with silver, but yeah. This is a nice Bugatti. Not just because I did the paint job. But I didn't do the full paint job. Did I? No, I didn't. So, it was nice before. It's still nice, just not as nice. I don't know if I ruined it or made it better. You guys can comment down below, but once again, my cars. You don't get them. Okay, moving on to McLaren's. So, I did have four Senna's at one point. I had three blue ones. And one orange. But, I think I told you this already. I went to Hobby Lobby, tried to get some stuff so that I could go over the paint job with a different paint job. Because I wanted to tell them apart. I failed on my fastest McLaren, which was my fastest car. Which was a horrible decision. Don't paint over your cars, kids. Because it didn't really work out in... There's only three centers here. So, don't do that. 
and definitely don't sell them because I didn't sell them, I just threw it away, but it looked like trash. So, anyways, off of that, the only thing I really did to these centers, I believe this is my fastest center, is that I tried to make the outline of the lights, and I did the black on the inside of these wind panels. I don't, I'm not sure what those are. And I thought I knew a lot about cars, but I guess I should really look up more than just how much they are, what horsepower they have, and how many miles per hour they go. So, I did basically the same on all of these. They already had the back lights, so thank you Hot Wheels. So that's basically all I did. And same for the orange one. Just oh, you can tell better on this one. This is nice. And just did the panels and that. And I already had the lights, but it kind of blends in. It's it's pretty cool though. These are my. I really love McLaren. So these these were cool. So three centers. And then I already showed you the P1. So, let's move on to the next one, which would be McLaren 72OS, which, also one of my favorites, they have the lights. That's a nice touch. They don't have the lights on the back, but I can tell why, because, I mean, it's kind of like the, the Porsche 918 Spider. You can't really do much back there, because it's kind of hard on the slope, so totally understand they have the black in the panels right there that that's cool it's just a really nice car I know that Hot Wheels released a different like two different colors they, they, they released a white version a while ago and now the next version is purple I think I think that purple one kinda looks like the one in Fast and Furious Hobbs and Shaw I think I'm saying that right but yeah they had a McLaren Center but I haven't seen that yet I want to anyways so Nice car. That is in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleventh place. And then the F1. P uh, not P1 F1. McLaren F1. So another nice car. I feel like I don't know. Do you think the McLaren F1 is cooler than the McLaren 72 OS? Which I say 72 OS. It could be 720s, or, I don't know. You guys say it however you want. But, which one is nicer looking to you guys? You guys should comment down below which one should be in first and second. Because, like, technically this would be in 10th and this would be in 11th, but, I don't know. So, F1, 72OS, P1, and Senna's. Those are all my, all my McLarens so far. And then it moves on to... I think it moves on to Acuras. I think I'm right. Huh. I'm missing a car. I think I'm missing a car. That's not good. Anyways, so I will end the video here pretty soon because I gotta find that Acura NSX. But this is my other Acura NSX. This was my fastest car for a little while. That's why I went over it in black Sharpie. It still has the lights, you if you can tell. Still kind of has the front. And it has the logo. And then the back lights. I kind of messed up. I kind of went over the back lights a little bit on accident. So it should go through all the way through the top of that. But, yeah. Anyways, so, Acura NSX. So... That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 cars, which is less than I thought I would do, but I don't want to make this video super long. I will, oh, never mind. I will do one more car, the, the other Acura, Acura NSX. Okay, this is the first Acura NSX I got. It's a nice car. I like it. I tried to do the black panels, but I don't know. Anyways. So, and by the way, that's what the lights are supposed to look like, if you can tell, all the way through the top. But this one doesn't look quite the same. Anyways, so I did, I think, 14 cars. So with that, this video is getting pretty long. So I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching. I will make a couple more videos, probably two, where I show the rest of these cars. So stay tuned and...
please like and subscribe. And goodbye.